Welcome back to my YouTube channel. We have just arrived at Costa del Sol. I've been looking forward to this so much ever since I saw it in the trailers. And it's finally happening. So I hope you guys are ready to relax. Enjoy a pina colada. Maybe go on a couple dates. We'll see what Costa del Sol has in store for us. If you guys like this video, like, subscribe, leave a reply. Do all that fun stuff because it really helps me. Which in turn helps you. Because that means I can continue making entertaining content and reactions that hopefully you're enjoying. Thank you so much for watching and enjoy the playthrough. Wait, why are Tifa and Eris standing there? They're about to kiss on the beach! So funny how they do the same pose. They're so cute. I love them. I love them. I love them. I love that you interrupted the girl talk. They'll be fine. <gasps> Wait, I want one of these. Wait, I want one so bad! The segways! Costa del Sol. Welcome. Right this way, please. <gasps> it's time. It's time. Whoa! These things are fast as f Okay. <laughs> Aerith, we should get you one of these outfits. You look so cute. Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh, shit. I'm so good at this. It's kind of fucked up that only Cloud gets a segue. Look, Aerith, the flower wagon. What? Is that Yuffie? Oh, my God. Yuffie, how did you change already? Hey, Cloud. Want some ice cream to cool down? Or are you looking for something hot? Just admit it. You're obviously captivated by my bodacious beach bot. Yeah. Come on. Can't you take a hint? She's crazy, bro. I have no idea what you're talking about. But if I was part of the group, I'm sure we'd learn to communicate much better. They really made her look so young, didn't they? Think of the comic relief I bring to the team. Is a much needed youthful energy. <laughs> She's cute. Excuse me, sorry. Sorry, I just ran that man over. Let's go to the beach. Beach. Oh, sorry. Oh, I just destroyed that bench. <laughs> Damn it. Excuse me. Excuse me. Hope you don't mind. Excuse me. <laughs> Johnny? No way. Johnny? <sighs> Whew. Hey guys! Looking good! <laughs> Same to you. So, what are you doing here? Living the dream! Building my legend! Being the owner of a bona fide hotel! Though not exactly <laughs> a luxury one. What a coincidence! We were just looking for a place to stay. Do you have any rooms? Do I have rooms? I got rooms for days! Enough rooms to make your head spin! <laughs> That's what happens when you have no guests. <laughs> I don't know about this. Don't need to be shy. We go way back, right? <laughs> it's the least I can do. <laughs> All right, let's get you settled in. Now? Come on! <laughs> that works out perfectly. Yay! Just bought the place, so I'm still doing repairs here and there. But all things considered, it's looking pretty sweet. How I got my hands on it, though. That's a story. I was cursed to the unholy trinity. No job, no money, and worst of all, no girl. <gasps> they put Omega in here, bro! Garbage. But Mayor Capone oh me. shit! Said I was destined to make something of myself. Omega, oh so they put you in the game, brother. How cheap, you ask? 
half market price hey, cheap. The dude offer, even dude. loaned me the money for it. There's no kinder man in all the world. Johnny, I don't like the look of this. Hey guys! <laughs> Behold my pride and joy, Johnny's Seaside Inn. <sighs> wow. Oh, I feel so bad for my princesses. Know. Great. Aw, Tim is so right? nice. Maybe my eyes are failing me, but I don't see no seaside. It's not about the sights, but the smells. Ah, how that <laughs> fresh salt air tickles the nose. <laughs> well, come on in. I love Erin. She's so funny. That's the Excalibur in Vegas. Okay, let's get everyone checked in. Tifa, you'll be staying in room 101. Aerith, you're in 102. As for the dudes, you can all bunk together in 103. The price? I'd never even think of charging you. Besides, Aww. Uh, I gotta run. The mayor requires my assistance at this time. Make yourselves at home. Not like there's anyone else here anyway. Oh, you guys better not head to the beach looking like that. And don't even think of bringing those weapons with you. Oh. Fate is so cruel, depriving me of Tifa and beachwear. <gasps> Time for that shower? Yeah, <gasps> I'd say so. <laughs> he just like me. He just like me. How soon is soon? <laughs> soon enough. No need to stick to a schedule here. True. Right? True. Right. Oh, man. Think I'll go take a walk. No, I should maybe get changed first. <laughs> And this again, Barrett! Well, back in a bit. Why that, Barrett? Put Barrett in a bathing suit! Give me Barrett bare chest! <gasps> Hi, Red. Well ventilated, plenty of shade, a lovely hotel. <laughs> I love Red. He's so content with life. Hold down the fort till I get back. Wait, no, don't take that off, Cloud! Allah, Allah! Why did he take that off? I mean, I guess there's a shower at least. Where's the bathroom? I think I found the bathroom, you guys. Just the God intended. Aerith is taking a shower! Let me in! Let me in! <laughs> <laughs> uh, this looks like it'll collapse if I try to sit on it. Much less sleep. Oh, Tifa's gonna take a little nappy nap. We must make sure she's... Are you okay in there, Poop? I think Tifa's bed just collapsed. Tifa? Are you okay? She died. I hope she's okay. Oh my god! She's breaking everything! What's a stand-up guy like you staying at a dump like this for? I can show you somewhere way better. Place is a sty, right? Whole building's barely worth a hundred gil, and yet the owner's drowning in debt to keep it open. Takes a special kind of sucker to wind up in a mess like that, you know? Oh, Johnny bankruptcy kind of arc? Sucker to wind up in a mess yeah, like that. that's rough. Wait, I don't like leaving the two girls in that house when you're just standing here like a fucking creep. You come with me. Here, I'll, I'll see you out. Get away from this house. They have Red there. You're good. That's true. Red is there watching over them. Fine. Just know I'll snap your fucking neck if you even look at them. Hang loose. Don't tell me you're alone. Hey, how about an orb or two? Surf and salt in. And one's not a party. It's a pity. But you don't have to be lonely any longer. We're bringing people together. Solo sun tanners like you. For the special event. One we guarantee will spice up your social life. Find love at Costa Del Amor. So, will you be joining us or what? 
I'll pass. Aww. <laughs> Got plans with those guys. Later. Uh, uh, so, they're friends of yours? Then, can you do us a solid? Those roped people are a little different, right? And they've kind of been creeping the other guests out. I like I these girls. Pose, they kill the vibe. So, if you could get them out of here, we'd be so grateful. Speaking of clothes, they'll never let you on the beach looking like that. This is Costa del Sol. You gotta loosen up. Let it all out. And to help you with that, here's lucky ticket number seven. Take it. With that, you can play Pirate's Rampage and Card Carnival. But not all by your lonesome. Your number's the same as someone else's. Mm -hmm. Find them, and you've got yourself a team. Work together, master the games, and you'll earn companion cards. <laughs> you can turn those in for beachwear. And once you're dressed to impress, you'll finally be ready to hit the beach. Right? right? So start searching and let the fun begin. Best of luck finding that special someone. <laughs> Hang <Hey>, loose! <laughs> Okay, how do we give Aerith card number seven? There's a girl in a pink bow coming from this place, same place I came from, okay? She's gonna, she has a pink bow, she wears a braid. Her hair is beautifully long, super soft, glistens in the sunlight. She has these eyes, these eyes that are just so full of life. The most beautiful eyes you've ever seen in the world. Her lips, her lips are a a peach pink very soft very moist okay she has very kissable lips the moment she makes eye contact with you you're gonna give her that ticket give her ticket number seven ticket number seven you think they'll know <laughs> where's my fucking segue i've been robbed my segue got robbed grab a yellow one man johnny took it To go on a oh, Barrett! The culprit! The Segway robber! Barrett, you just can't take people's Segways without asking! Uh, caught red-handed. 4K! Hey, got a ticket for this thing called Costa Del Amor. Don't know what it is, but it's happening here, so... It's a special event for uh, meeting new people. But... Looks like you and me got paired up. What? what? Why do you care about meeting new people? For the companion cards. What do we have here? Looks like it's right up my alley. Oh my Whoa, god! You use firearms for a living, don't you? They're in bonding Sorry, arc! Let's fucking game. go! Amateurs only. That's our policy. Oh, it is, is it? Why didn't you speak up sooner? I don't see any signs either. This is false advertising. You know that. Let me speak to your manager. Let me speak to your manager. Just don't embarrass us. Fine. Blast him in the next week. Yeah, I'll blast this guy's fucking face off too. You hear me? Once you have them in your sight, fire away. How do I reload? Oh, 
How did I do? Wait, did I not hit the target score? Oh, you hit the target. You hit one target score. 15k for a big prize. Oh. Ain't the greatest, sure, but we'll take what we can get. Well done, gentlemen. With play like that. What happens if you get like a highest? The shooting and the shouting was a sight to behold. <laughs> you hear that? A sight to behold. It's his job to butter us up. I think you get a time material. Oh, oh okay. On, man. Just drop the jaded act for a minute and take the compliment. Aww. Hotel. Anyhow, I'm off to enjoy the beach. Don't leave me hanging too long here. Aww. Want to play card carnival? It's hey there. Fun. What's up? Oh, let me guess. Searching for a more partner? I am. <laughs> and now you found her. Just so you know, the rules are different for this event. Instead of the usual one-on-one -on -one format, we have to play in teams, which is why I'm glad you're here. I'm sure this won't come as a shock, but I didn't sign up to lose. Why does she have the Kingdom know, Hearts hearts? To worry about. The Kingdom Maybe Hearts earrings, bro. Do you see that? Then step right on up. Namura. She's a prototype character for the next game, no doubt. Finish him off. What? Yes, just yikes. Keep that up and you'll be fine. Did I solve it? <laughs> I understand now. Congratulations. You two sure know how to win in I understand Done now. You like. Thanks for being my partner. Haven't had that much fun in a while. I could be persuaded to go again. That's a funny way of asking for a favor. <laughs> I appreciate the sentiment, but I don't play matches I already know I'm gonna win. Would much rather spend that time up in my Bitch, game. didn't we, like, knock your ass out of the tournament? Sadly, I don't meet many people who can teach me much. Though I did run into you. Anyway, I'm sure we'll see each other around sometime. Good luck. Oh my, shot you down. We also offer one-on-one -on -one matches, though. So don't worry about it. Sorry, girly pop. He's taken. Look, we're just zooming through the city without any issues. Other than running those people over just now. So if you go shirtless, she has to go in her full bikini. Oh, that's how they do it? Oh, I see. So if he's in his full bikini, they're in there. Okay, I get it. Dude, the pants here are ugly. I like this one. He looks mad chill though, does he though? I'm having a midlife crisis. I'm having a midlife crisis. Okay, I have a question. Is it possible to put Tifa in the bikini and Aerith in the other outfit? Yes. Oh, sh**. 
And so if I want Aerith in her like long skirt, then I have to choose this one. Okay, then I'll do this one. If I can have Aerith in her long, like her long pretty pink skirt with the jean shorts, that outfit is so fucking cute. If they all sink, then this will affect their affinity. Yeah, but I want to have highest affinity with Aerith. My BF chose uh, shirtless cloud and long skirt Aerith. Yeah, see, I want to choose, I want to choose uh, long skirt Aerith. Looks like you're more than ready to enjoy the beach. Would you like to head on down there? Do I go to the beach? Wearing shoes in the sand. I know, wearing shoes in the sand gives me the ick. <laughs> I want that one. Maybe later. <gasps> What's with them? Talk about killing the vibe. Hey, what's up? They're getting some sun too, huh? Yeah. Just can't help but feel sorry oh, for them, you know? Uh, Poor bastards ain't done nothing to nobody. Creeps. But we treat them like monsters all the same. You're freaking everyone out. For real. Take a hike. Hey, you leave them alone! Leave them alone! <laughs> I love Barrett so much. Leave him alone! They have every right to enjoy their vacation like everyone else, assholes. <laughs> He's sleeping on his back! Thanks for keeping watch. I'll only be a sec. Aww. Take your time. Uh, well, the water won't turn off. Johnny sure found himself Damn, really Red sounded forever. crazy just there. Kind of reminds me of home. Are you almost done? Aerith? Aerith, are you all right? Tommy. <gasps> What color would you say this is? None. Thing is, it used to be white. My At beautiful girl, my beautiful girl. Materia is formed from the life stream itself. Orbs infused with knowledge, memories. The whispers. They took all that from mine? These memories were precious? Yes. Extremely. Weren't you headed to the beach? Some time with Tifa might lift your spirits. They took all of her memories. Her very precious memories. They took them. My beautiful girl. <laughs> She's so pretty. Why are we in Cloud's room? Why did we take a shower in Cloud's room? Aerith, you are crazy. <laughs> She's just like me. <laughs> Go to the underwear drawer? I don't know if there's an underwear drawer here. Wandering around alone would be ill-advised. I insist you take Tifa. I insist you take Tifa. Come on, don't be such a bummer. Oh, we can't leave. Come on! Hey, Tifa. You ready to soak up the sun? Because I sure am. Uh, yeah. In a sec. Ready. <gasps> now, let's find us some resort wear. And then we can finally hit the beach. Are we going on an yeah. arty date? Let's roll. <laughs> oh my god, we're going on an arty date? What? Oh my god. At any time during their date, know that you who, that who you control will not affect the story. Canonical arty date. Okay, maybe Artie isn't 
a crack ship as much as I thought it was. Maybe it is not as much as a crack ship as I thought. Oh, and we got Red with us too. Let's go, Red. Let's go on our girl's date. On our girl's date. On our girl's date. Let's go on our girl's date. Hang loose. You ladies look like you're on the way down to the water. If you're in the market for some beach attire, why not participate in Costa Del Amor? What's that? A special event that'll make your time here unforgettable. And don't worry, your pet can join too. Well, in that case, sign me up. <laughs> Perfect. Then here's one ticket for the two of you. <gasps> we got Ticket Del Amor 77. With those tickets of yours, seven you and 77 is and good. And you can't miss the piano recital. So go out there and be sure to have yourself a ball. Hang loose! Hang loose! Hang loose! <laughs> Hang loose. Have some fun? <laughs> yeah. Let's go. Oh, shit! Yeah! <laughs> Today's first place prize is none other than Costa del Sol's famous tropical meat. So, do we have any takers? Don't be shy now. We have to get red that meat. You want some? Then I say go for it. <laughs> My, what beautiful red fur you have. Ready to run wild? Four teams duke it out in this ferocious battle to see who is the king of the jungle. Chase the ball around the field, then shoot into your opponents. <laughs> Try me. They block that. Yay. Am I in first still? Good boy. That yes, let's go. A companion card. Make sure to come back soon. Was it just as good as you were hoping? <laughs> let's go. Oh, second place prize? No, but I was first. On, Johnny boy. You can still make it in time. Johnny? Uh, Tifa? Wait. No. Someone stole her segue, bro. Why do I keep getting What is this arbitrary rule? Can't you make an exception just this once? Oh, or you, you could be my partner. Would that be okay? Uh, I, I don't think I'm allowed. Oh, uh, hi, how can I help you? <gasps> you, uh, th this isn't, uh, my, my surprise arrival uh, has been delayed. Is. So I thought it prudent to, uh, What are you eating, Coleslaw? That's nice. You know, if you're looking for a partner, why don't we team up? Huh? huh. You mean it? <laughs> I sure do. Aww. Oh, Aerith is so sweet. Saver. In that case, I'll go on ahead. Those She's such a sweetie pie. <sighs> okay then. Just take this camera and find the four cactuars hidden around town. All right, let the capers commence. If my man is not like this when I'm a, in a swimsuit, I don't want it. <laughs> That's so cute. Oh. 
Oh, that's stupid. I just love these little guys. Is this what they call love at first sight? Because I adore this cactuar. What the f***? The guy wants to have fellatio with cactuars? I don't judge. There's one here, I remember it. There we are. I remember this. Hey, a cactuar! Each little guy we find is one more happy memory we make together. Let's go find another! <laughs> I like this guy, though. That guy just stuck his nips in my face, bro. <laughs> my beautiful girl. <laughs> ah! She's like, she caught us! She caught us! <laughs> Sorry about that, Tifa. I'm trying to look for the cactuses. <laughs> Getting warmer. Warmer. You fucker. Oh, is someone shy? Hid yourself well, didn't you? <laughs> At this point, I this man is literally you. attracted to the pink cactuar. Just imagine how splendid it would be. I want the word kind of guy. Tifa, Eric. What are the two of you doing here? That's our question. And what's with the bag? Luggage for a Shinra executive. Gotta make sure it gets to his hotel safe and sound. Seriously? You're working for Shinra now? After all that talk about Kamara? Mayor's orders. After everything he's done for me, I gotta... Don't look at me like that! I'm not some dumb sellout! Aww. We should go. Yeah. Aw, right. poor Johnny. Poor Johnny, man. He's just trying to help out. <laughs> we have gotten ourselves into a predicament. <laughs> oh! prickly pal. I hate to think that these might be our last moments together. All those hours I wasted working that I could have been spending with you. And yet, I still hold fast to the Shinra creed. Loath though I am to part, I cannot shirk my duties forever. Oh, what am Bruh. I to do? The fuck is wrong with this guy? What is wrong with this freak? can close the book on the Cactuar Capers. <laughs> I suppose I ought to thank you for helping bring some Amor back into my life. Say, if you don't mind parting with them, I'd love to send those Cactuar photos to my wife and daughter. Just a small way of letting them know they're always in my thoughts. What? <laughs> Wait, I what? I really needed this. Can't lift my family's spirits if I can't lift my own. <sighs> Yes, sir. Is oh, forgive me. I'm on my way. Don't work too hard. Where should we go next? I know just the place. Oh, your turn. Got it. Oh, they're so cute. You want to take the lead for a bit? I'd be delighted. Their voice line. Do next, Tifa. Uh, Follow me, and you'll see. Me. Oh, their voice lines are so cute. Guide me, oh Tifa. Come, my child. Come, my child. Come, my child. Oh, that voice line is so good. Guide me, oh Tifa. Come, my child. Oh, they're bad. They're just so... Oh, they're so good. Oh, they're so good. I have no words. My brain is melting. They're so good. Oh, here we go. Oh, are you taking part in Wheelie Rendezvous? I'm 
so sorry. We, like, just stopped our wheelie rentals for the day. You're kidding me. What should we do instead, Tifa? Tifa? You're not from Sector <gasps> 7, are you? Tifa's Is famous! Huh? Yes, I am. Oh, Tifa! My light, my love, nay, my everything! You're not quoting Johnny, are you? <gasps> what a disappointment. See, I was expecting someone very different. Someone metropolitan and chic who lights up every room she walks into. I have no idea what he sees in you. Um, excuse me? Stow the toad? Oh. It's fine. <laughs> I, uh, I get this all the time. That's some kind of humble brag? Hey, Jenny! Don't just stand there. Go get the other Aerith, beat her ass! Don't tell me what to do. Oh, how come everyone here thinks they're better than me? Aerith, beat her ass! Screw this. I quit. Uh, Should have known this would happen. So, you're friends with her, right? Since she quit, would you mind picking up the rest of the wheelies for me? Yeah, sure. We'll do it. You don't have to please everyone you meet. I know, but I still feel like I owe it to Johnny. So Aww. I figure maybe if I do this for Jenny, I'll have given him back something. Or maybe I just want peace of mind. I guess. <laughs> Let's get those wheelies. Do I have to tell these guys to go back? Hey, what you gotta return the these. Well, already checked into the hotel. You gotta return your wheelies, <laughs> bitch! Return the wheelies! Johnny wants in a woman? An overachiever? Do you want to die? Right say here. something. Say something about Tifa one more time, you stupid f***ing... Perfectly executed. Again. And she even made it easy for the next person to grab one. If I'm impressed, what must Johnny think of her? Hey, Tifa, I think we need to Your switch turn. to you for this. Perfect partner yet? Don't miss out on this life-changing experience. We're missing a red wheelie somewhere. If you have a ticket, please proceed to the lobby. Oh, this is a really nice hotel. Why couldn't we? <laughs> Hello, Tifa. There's a concert scheduled today. What was, at least. Something came up, you see. The pianist decided to skip town. At least he was kind enough to leave behind a letter. Said he had decided to elope. What? Elope? The heart wants what it wants, and who are we to deny it? However, without a pianist, there can be no concert. These fools called us down here because Well, they Tifa knows how to play. Business. Even between the two of us, it's not like we know everyone in every business. Mm hmm. Oh my. These hands. These fingers. <laughs> you stay away from her. They have the strength of a Stay away they from her. Are so very delicate. You've played the piano before. That much is obvious. Yeah. I mean, kind of. I did take some lessons when I was a kid. <laughs> that was ages ago. I don't want to hear excuses. I want to hear you playing the goddamn piano. Now tickle the ivories. Okay, wait, hold on. Give me one second. Let me just return a segue. <gasps> Here you are. Today's Royal Coast concert. Find the love of your life today. Good God, it's just some dumb wheelies. Why does she care? <sighs> of course Johnny would fall for a girl like her. I've been going about this all wrong, haven't I? Jenny, over here. We brought all the wheelies back for you. I'm going to give up on Johnny. 
There's no way I could ever compete with you. My way of saying sorry. Take them. There's two cards there, so have fun. Hold up. Thanks, but that's way too generous. What? This one's for you and Johnny. I bet you'll have a more fun together. I think you've got <laughs> the wrong idea. Johnny and I are just friends, nothing more. For real? But the way he talks about you, I figured you were... You know he likes to exaggerate. True. <laughs> and of course, he also has a habit of getting carried away. I, I love a lot this. If he has someone to back him up, keep him out of trouble. Oh, so you're foisting him on me. Is that it? <laughs> Nothing like that. Sorry, forget I said anything. Anyway, thanks for the card. I'm glad we got all this straightened out. Oh, Tifa, she's the I T G I R L. I might as well shoot my shot then, huh? Oh. They did so well with Tifa and Rebirth. Like, actually a little too well. They just want to hone in that Tifa's not ever going to compete over a man. Like, that. that's beyond her. And she's always going to be nice and kind and supportive. And, like, these... I think this is the dev's way of saying that Tifa is not in competition for a man. And that's, like, she would never do that. They want to hone in, like, at the end of the day, Tifa's a very, very kind character. A kind, caring, and independent character. And competing over a man is beyond her. And I think they want the same for Aerith. I think this is the devs, like, saying, like, you guys are constantly making these two girls compete for a man, but they're not competing against each other. They love each other very much. It's very cute. Cute, very cute scene. Look at those fucking abs, bro. Look at those fucking abs. Holy sh! Okay. Shit. I'm trying my best, okay? Guys, we really are f we really may be fucked here. That moment <sighs> of roused from reverie, thanks to the occasional slip up. Oh, pardon me. Syncopation. A rather calming rendition. Now then, let's give our pianist a warm round of applause. I'm sorry, Tifa. Thank you so much for performing. Here you are a companion card and a memento. What we give all our concert goers. Now, as for what we're we getting owe better you for your performance. 
<laughs> I would totally get a ticket to your concert. Hey! First, there's the uncall rate. Then, there's my finder's fee. And on top of that... <laughs> I received word from the pianist who eloped. He and his partner left for a place where nothing can come between the two of them ever again. It seems your performance didn't just save the hotel's reputation. It also saved a relationship. <laughs> May the next time we meet be on the stage of the Honeybee Inn. Until then, well, can we get a room at the hotel then? <laughs> can we get a room at the hotel? Hang loose. Want to exchange companion cards for beachwear? This is the place. Independent florist, pride of seventh heaven. This one is so cute, though. I feel like this one doesn't get enough love. I love that one. This one is very cute. I must admit I love this one, though. I can't even lie. Seeing Tifa in something that has frills and is like... Very, like, girly pop is really nice because I feel like we always see Tifa in, like, very, uh... What is it called? Like, not tomboyish, but, like, we don't see her in super girly things. So it's super nice to see her in, like, something that has frills and is girly. So this is the bikini for Aerith. The pink mermaid. She's so cute. But this one is just so her. Look at the shoes. This one is so Aerith. Oh, this is so cute. Oh, my girls. My girls. Your turn. Got it. Bruh. <laughs> Good God Almighty. That's crazy. I don't want to end our date, man. Tifa, I don't want to end this. Where to next, Tifa? Oh, they look cute. They look cute. We could kiss right now, Aerith. Nice touch. I can tell you're just dying to hit the beach right about now. Ready to rock? Do you even have to ask? <laughs> well, Red, how do we look? Huh? <laughs> Tifa, you look as sleek as a dolphin, and you, Eric. Are as luminous as a sea snail. Cloud and Earth have the same taste as beachwear! Oh, ah! Complimenting us? Human beauty is hard for me to assess. <laughs> as sleek as a sea snail. Look at these two. Not even trying to blend in. Uh, Honestly. Look at Red! Cloud? Something wrong? Uh, no. Nothing. It's just hot. Uh, in the sun. Speaking of which, you guys should probably put on sunscreen. Ah! Oh! Okay. Can you get my back then? Yeah, he's gonna put sunscreen on Aerith's back? Make way, people. Back it up. What? Hey. Oh, Joe. What a wonderful surprise it is to see you again. Why is he f***ing here? Uh, rest assured, I'm not here for Aerith. Though, were she to offer her assistance, I'd gladly accept. Don't Why the f*** is he here? Oh, I won't. At any rate, 
A very special show is about to start. One starring you, perhaps. Now this is so much fun. Hey, what what the f <laughs> Did he bewitch those women? So what say you? Care to join me in the lab? If you girls sign up with Shinra, you'll be set for life. Wow, that's quite an offer. And as luck would have it, I'm in need of a few female assistants. <laughs> Think about it. You could help give birth to the world's next hero. That would be so cool. Before a hero strikes down his foe... Look how pretty the flowers the are in her hair! He is not a hero by virtue of innate... <laughs> oh my Only god! Does he earn the title? Oh my Do god! You are you still talking? Too often Shut the f*** up! Sounds amazing. Professor, so glad you could make it. Hi, Eris. My girls are making you feel welcome. Do you listen There's to Hojo? No. You're the man in a white coat. Say, Professor, how about I polish those glasses for you? Care to savor some of the local delicacies, Professor? Here, open wide. I'm gonna say something really fucking mean. <laughs> say it, Eris. Say it. I. I can't. <laughs> I'll get in trouble. <laughs> so you heeded the call too, did you? What are you talking about? <laughs> Not consciously, then. As you can see, your brothers down there are having a little get-together. He asked those girls if they wanted to give birth to the next hero? Yes, sir. What the f***? What? What the hell are you playing at? Leave them alone! That's my friends, is for me to know and for you to find out. <laughs> what? Splendid. Might you be interested in bringing a new hero Let to life? Go! Oh my god! I ask your compliance, <laughs> for the sake of the scientific process. 
Afraid she slayed. I love Yuffie. Tender, so I uh helped myself. Costa del Sol used to make him back at the bar, and here I am. 
drinking wine in its namesake. God damn. It feels like it's been ages since I mixed a drink. Jesus since Christ. Seventh heaven. <laughs> Yeah. Well, it's happened since then. A lot. Good and bad. Ever wish you could just... <laughs> snap your fingers and forget the worst stuff? It's a part of who we are. Whether we like it or not. Yeah. The deepest wounds never really heal. Hey, I can make one for you too, if you want. Nah, I'm good. <laughs> Next time I ask for a cocktail, it'll be at the new Seventh Heaven. At least... That's what I promised Barrett. And when exactly did you promise him that? Sometime. All right, Mr. Secretive. You do you. I love Tifa in this game. I love her a lot. They did such a good job with her. Hope I can come back here someday. Stare at the ocean. Listen to the waves. Maybe we build a new seventh heaven here, Tifa, on the beach. It's because of Hojo this place is in ruins. No. I can't blame him for our actions. I know I should strive to maintain my composure around him, but... Don't sweat it. Anyone would want to punch that smug asshole. I know I do. <laughs> Your fists and my fangs. You should go check on the others. Oh, there he is. Hi, Barrett. Hate to say it. That girl really came through for us back there. Unlike me, I couldn't do a damn thing for those poor bastards. You tried. That's all you can do. And all that matters if you ask me. <laughs> you? Trying to tear me up? Now I've seen everything. Hope I get to bring Marlene here someday. I knew she'd love it. <laughs> Hope I get to bring Marlene here. You will day. bring Marlene here. <laughs> Look how pretty my girl is. My beautiful girl. Staring out into the open water. Wait, hold on. This is a really nice view. I'm gonna take a picture. Wait. I love them. <laughs> I love them. We've come so far, but it still feels like Midgar's right behind us. We were his prisoners, me and my mom, Ethalna. He kidnapped us because she was a Cetra. A specimen for his experiments. And after what he did to her... After all the pain and the horror he put us through... I hate him. Sometimes... I imagine the things I'd do to him if I got the chance. I start thinking things so dark and ugly that it scares me. They're just thoughts. Let them be dark and ugly. You're not. You think so? Aww. What I'm trying to say is, worry about the future when it comes. You'll know what to do. And whatever you decide, I'm with you. I appreciate it. Ah! Shall we? Oh my god! No need to worry about the future till it comes. Not until the moment arrives. And when it does, I'll be counting on you. Good. Not you. That was to her. My future self. Oh, she's so cute! <laughs> Can't say when you'll meet, but trust me, you'll love her. Just you wait. What 
did she mean? Talking to my future self. When you meet her, you'll love her. I love them so much. I love their relationship. I love her. She's everything to me. She's everything to me. I love her. <laughs> She's so cute. Everything about her. <laughs> I don't want to leave this spot. We stay in this spot the whole game. It's moments like these we have to hold on to. That's crazy that I can just go in the water and swim. Do you guys know who this looks like? He's f***ing Steve from Tekken. Yes, Typhon. He's Steve Fox from Tekken. It was on the tip of my tongue. Well, guess this ends our fun in the sun. Yeah, no fun <laughs> ain't the word I'd use. So, back to the hotel? Johnny's famous sea smell in. Aw, pretty girl. Pretty girl. <laughs> Our stream is clear with HQ. Maybe a little. What's up, guys? Johnny, are you all right? <laughs> Never felt better. You're the man of the hour. I don't know. You see, a few kind girls who saw what happened on the beach gave me the lowdown. On the hotel and Mayor Capono. Ugh, I'm a moron. How could I be so blind? Aww. They made Johnny way you more bearable, though, for, for sure. Him, right? Will you be able to pay it back? So, the girls told Capono. Keep leeching off our hero, and we'll smear your name so bad Shinra will kick you to the curb. And the crazy thing is, it worked. He caved. I am footloose and dead free, baby. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> Johnny, the local hero. Proprietor of the Seaside Inn, soon to be Seven Star Resort Hotel. Now that would be something. You know you gotta get one star before you can get the other six, right? Damn. <laughs> God Very damn. Funny, but I got plans. Ow, ow, she ow, looks ow, so ow. good. Good for you. <laughs> uh, you okay there? Great. Now watch him fall up the stairs. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for everything. Nah, I should be the one thanking you. Anyway, what's next for you guys? Gotta follow some ropes. Oh, those dudes shuffled off toward Mount Corel this morning. Tried to get the injured ones to stay till they were healthy, but... Corel, huh? Corel it is. Be safe, you guys. Wouldn't want anything to happen to my inaugural guests. Bon voyage. Bon voyage. Man, fun's over. Uh, hello? Aren't you all forgetting about someone? And... Action! Some know me as the world's greatest materia hunter. Others, an unstoppable assassin. And the rest, a benevolent and beautiful ninja. But, who am I truly? Oh shit. Cool. <laughs> uh, hey, hold it, you spiky hair jerk face. Where do you think you're going? I challenge you to a duel. If I win, you get the honor of serving yours truly. However, if you manage to somehow fluke your way to victory, this amazing ninja will agree to join you. <laughs> what do you say? What do I say? Oh, it's like that, huh? Where's your pride? Your fighting spirit? <laughs> <laughs> What's the matter? Afraid you're about to catch a beat down? Oh, 
wait. Seriously? I mean, uh, we don't actually have to fight. That is, unless you really want to. <laughs> oh, abort, abort! Tactical retreat! <laughs> <laughs> okay um i thought she was joining the party what happened you were you not supposed to join the party um that just happened hey where do you think you're going <laughs> think this through are you absolutely 100 oh we're back certain you don't want me around to save your butt do i say no we don't just let me in already! Fine then. I know when to take a hint. You don't want me? I'll leave. Then you'll never, ever see me again! <laughs> Have fun. I was joking! You gotta believe me! Please let me be one of the gang! If you really wanna, I won't stop you. Really? You won't? Freaking sweet! Welcome to the team, Yuffie. <laughs> you try anything funny, anything. I'll shove you in the sister ray, point it at Wu Tai, and blast you back home. Yeesh. <laughs> but I hear ya. Spirit! <laughs> <laughs> you won't regret this, or my name isn't Yuffie Kisaragi. This. Oh, this girl is looking at my f***ing materia. <laughs> She's scoping us out. Oh, we can wear this? What? Oh, that's cute. What's up, bro? Forget something? Or did you just miss the unbeatable ambiance of my seaside paradise? Either way, I'm glad you're here, because I was actually hoping to ask you for a little favor. As you know, your boy's debt-free. Figured I'd make the most of my financial solvency and give the inn a total makeover. Thing is... You short on hands? Ah, uh, if only, my dear bro. Kind of the opposite problem, actually. Oh, Johnny, a name thou hast claimed is thine! But if thou truly Johnny B, then who, pray tell, am I? So yeah, it's your classic existential crisis. You get the idea. No, I don't know what's going on. Beds have all been made. What's next? Huh? Oh, hey, bro. I, I, I told you to stay out of sight. You're just going to confuse them. Aren't you supposed to be out shopping anyway? Go on, shoot. Aww. Well, okay. How come he gets to talk to my bro and I don't? So unfair. Uh, <sighs> see what I have to deal with? <laughs> Think you're surprised? Imagine how I felt. Good day, sir. I saw your help wanted ad. Oh, that's... Say, you look awfully familiar. Too familiar. You look exactly like me. No, please, stay back! Don't come any closer! Ah, ah! Okay, that last part was just a joke, but... This wouldn't have anything to do with me. Using my ninja skills to create a bunch of clones, would it? Turns out a few of them managed to stick around somehow. And I think they might have even multiplied. <laughs> I mean, I never doubted my amazing abilities, but even I didn't realize I was capable of doing that. <laughs> But hey, look on the bright side. At least you aren't short-staffed. Oh, but I am. I sent a crew to fetch materials and haven't heard a word from them since. Turns out I can't rely on myself. My other selves. I'm begging you, bro. You gotta help me out here. A Johnny's a wild beast that can't be tamed. You know that. There's no telling what sort of havoc these bad boys might wreak. Uh-huh. Maybe we should lend him a hand? Uh-huh. <sighs> Fine. Yes! I knew I could count on you, bro! I sent them off to the Costa Falls to look for materials for the renovations. I want to start there. You're the one who got into it with that Shinra scientist. Oh, wow, it is you! I'm Fran. 
And I'm Naomi. Name's Yorda. And God we damn. Will tell you for a job. Interesting. God damn. It's simple. Girl and boy go on a date. Easy peasy, right? A date? The three of us are designers for Costa del Sol's premier fashion boutique. For our next line, we're thinking something sexy. Perfect for the beach, the bar, or in the boudoir. But creatively speaking, it's been a struggle. We've been racking our brains forever. No way. And the showcase is basically now. It's do or die, and we don't want to kill our careers. No way. So, that's where you come in. We want to see a real couple on a date for inspiration. Well, sound like a good gig? Because we can tell you like your women assertive. And since we're all about strong, confident ladies, we thought, ka-ching! One look at you and we knew. That woman's not afraid to take what she wants. Maybe? I mean, uh, I'd like to think so. We knew you would. And so, we've already planned the perfect date for lovebirds like Love you. Lovebirds! Uh... run wild. What? Buckle at Pirate's Rampage. This is going to be your best date yet. We'll make sure that... <sighs> Wait, is this Aerith's quest? This is Aerith's side quest. Aerith, let's go on a date, Pookie. This is one of the stranger jobs you've accepted. Still a job. I'll take the lead. <laughs> hey, I can help. I'll make this date our best date. Oh, we can just keep it simple. And what's a simple date in your world? Like a walk? Across rooftops, perhaps? Sure. Oh! <laughs> Look who it is. So, are you ready to aim and fire? Yes. Do well, and you might just land a bullseye on her heart. Oh, so I have to do really good in all these mini games, huh? Special dialogue. <laughs> wow, look at that score. Those were some pro numbers. But what did the lady think? Oh, got me right through the heart, the cat. <laughs> you know, the secret is to aim for the head, not the heart. <gasps> You're such an asshole! And the way she stared at him, the score doesn't matter. Thanks, cuties. That was oh, so worth it. It was so worth it. You two it. Are so worth you it. Two still have a date to finish. Go find Naomi at Run Wild. It was so worth it. Uh, he's just trying to be cool. I know he's trying so. He's trying so hard to keep the banter up with her and like to like. He's trying so hard to be cool. <laughs> He's like, damn, how do I keep Aerith on her toes? I love, I love their banter so much. Oh my God. I wonder what the girls have next on the agenda for us. More cheap date ideas? Oh, lighten up. We're trying to enjoy ourselves. We're stuck with trying to get paid. You're no fun at all today. Cloudy. For the record, I am treating this as a date. I wish you wouldn't. Why? Because I'm no romantic. Oh! Uh, <laughs> oh! He sounds like kind of like bummed out. Like I'm not romantic, Aerith. It's like it's almost like he feels bad. It's almost like he feels bad for not being able to be like romantic. Dude, this is so cute. Someone took their sweet time. I see. Better hurry, or the game will start without you. What game? Run wild, of course. Tell me you've heard of it. It's only the hottest sport in town. Not hard to guess why. Bro so got the anti-riz. He does. He's and got negative riz. Spot for a date. Are you ready to go? All right. Wish me luck, okay? You do know this is for animals, right? Not people. <laughs> people are technically animals too, right? So it's cool. Wrong. 
not cool. What? I really can't compete? Oh, no, poor Aerith. But though I take umbrage with that nomenclature, I'm happy to offer my assistance. Red's got this. <sighs> well, I guess we'll just have to be the cheer squad. <laughs> Wait, did I do it perfectly? You were like a red bolt shooting across Let's the Let's go! Field. First try! I am quick on my feet. The three of us should go around sometime. Wouldn't that be fun? <laughs> if you enjoy losing. <laughs> their dog is the glue that binds their relationship. And watching their little guy give it his all out there only serves to strengthen their bond. That's it! I'm such a genius! I've got to get this idea down on paper. I need to get back to the shop, like yesterday. Oh! You're always at the stables for the final part of your date. So what are you waiting for? Get those tushies on a chocobo. Yo! Wonder what sort Wait. of girls are gonna come up with. I don't hey, want this quest to be over. <laughs> yes, you. I'm curious. Well, I prefer function over form, so durable. Maybe made with non-absorbent materials that allow for full range of motion. In case you need to fight underwater. <laughs> Okie dokie then. He's such a dork. He's such a dork, bro. There you are. Okay, I've got a great activity for you. Before that, though, I need to add your information to the system. Here, take this. It'll let you rent a chocobo whenever. That's Kaima. Take good care of her. So the idea is to ride Kaima <gasps> here and enjoy a romantic stroll along the beach. Oh. <laughs> that on its own sounds like a huge yawn fest. So try hunting no! for shells while you're No! How about you bring me the largest one you can find? You're not, you have no idea what I'll you've stolen from here. me! So you two run along and have yourselves one shell of a time. You have no idea what you've stolen from me I don't know about you but this is definitely a first for me you've ridden them before I'm not talking about the chocobos oh you meant the shells right right <sighs> cloud is so are you nervous about what easiest job I've ever had the Merc's nervous Oh my god! Okay, I, I was, I'm gonna be honest. I have no idea what I'm doing. I just... <laughs> we should be able to find some good shells around here. But first, we clean up the trash. Let's do it together. Can you take over? <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> All right, seashells. Ready or not, here we come. <sighs> Let's saddle up first, then search. Sounds good. Back on the Aww. birds we go. <laughs> She's so cute. <laughs> Bro! seen a shell this big before. Hmm, if these things are all this size, I bet the suckers who live in them would make for good eating. wonder how they taste. <laughs> we could ask a local, but you don't strike me as the type to care all that much. It's so teeny tiny. You know, a lot of troopers take half a shell with them when they head out on missions. I know where this is going. It's meant to be a keepsake for their partner, right? A symbol of their undying love. And an omen of death for the trooper if anyone else sees either one. Some people say. Oh, that took a turn. They are so funny. <laughs> they are so funny. Nice, a punch. 
Yay! This is one too. Whew. I think that should just about do it. Okay, ready to go? Are you sure? Really? Leaving the decision to me? What about you, Cloud? Are you sure? This is the part where you're supposed to blurt out. I don't want to go back. I want to stay here with you. <laughs> this date's DOA otherwise. Okay, now you're just being mean. I'm not trying to be mean. I... Oh I... my god! Oh my god! Uh, they are so cute. They are so cute. I really love them so much. Yeah, they talk like an old married couple. And the way she teases him is so funny. right dang that thing belongs in a museum or something i can't help but wonder what is making her smile from ear to ear like that is it the shelves or <laughs> i've got it inspiration has finally struck i know what to make but before i go swing by the fashion showcase we want you front row center see you there oh <gasps> We get front row center. Next time we need a chocobo, I say we ride double. Then slow down the bird. Which would make it that much easier to take in all the steering. I agree, Aerith. I I'm agree. Still steering. <laughs> oh, fine. If you've got to be the man up front. Cloud agreed to it. There's no fucking way. Cloud agreed. Ah! Both of these characters have like um, a really competitive spirit. And so because they're both naturally competitive people, I feel like it's because they keep, they have to keep bantering with each other. Who's gonna one up who? So the conversation is always like, the core of the conversation is always pulling on each side. You know what I mean? Oh, well, I'm gonna compete this way. Well, I'm gonna tease you this way. Well, I'm gonna make you break first. It's like, who can like, who can get who to like break first, break character first? It's so cute. It's so cute. Aerith likes to yank the chain, literally. And Cloud's like, well, I'm not going to lose to her that easily. You're not going to get me flustered and nervous that easily, Aerith. That's cute. That is, they're so cute. They're so cute. Oh, damn! Wanna shoot your shot? This swimsuit's got perfect aim. <laughs> well, oh, it might be a game, shit! But you'll never lose in this winning ensemble. Wanna land a big catch? With this look, it'll be hook, line, and sinker. Oh, my God! <laughs> doesn't ache for that perfect swimsuit physique. You wanna get hey, yeah, Jules. You Jules is back. Then you better train with the best of the best. So so come come join our gym. Gym. They're get teaching you how to get a beach pod. I'm so glad you came. So, what did you think I of the show? Them. You were the inspo after all. I absolutely loved it. Aerith being the inspo is so Boy, cute. Is that That's what we wanted. Happy couples get us inspired and fired up. Exactly. This place is more than just a vacay spot. <laughs> it's a paradise where people come to create lifelong memories. And making sure they do is what we do best. So next time you swing by, promise to frolic in the waters, bask in the sun, Enjoy our town to its fullest and leave with a smile. <laughs> Do my eyes deceive me? Is that Cloud? Oh, hey! You trade the city for the beach, too? What are you doing here? Relaxing, really. We're on our yearly beach retreat. And commissioning this year's new singlets from these talented young women. <laughs> oh, right. That reminds me. Stop by the training facility when you have a moment. We're in need of your particular skills. I wonder what we could be doing okay. at the training facility. <gasps> He's doing the squats! He's doing the squats! T 
Tifa's like, I am not doing that. Yee! Look at them! Stop, my bro! What are you doing here? Uh, Johnny sent me to check on you guys. Help you find materials. Oh, that was pretty smart of me. No one knows me better than myself. And this whole synchronized talking thing is kind of creepy. We had actually already gathered everything we needed, but then we ran into some fiends and had to zip line for our lives. So unless they took our stuff for some weird reason, everything should still be right where we dropped it. We think, you'll help us get it all back, won't you, bro? The more pieces you pick up, the better off me and me will be. So, you find, you find anything, anything, bro? They ought to be all around the zip lines, right where we dropped them. You'd be doing us a solid by tracking them down. Come on, don't leave us hanging. We need your help. What zip lines, though? This is gonna be tough with just us. Oh, maybe I could make some clones of me and you to help out. That is a terrible idea. Uh, I think you meant to say terrific idea. Come on, Cloud. Just imagine how much fun it could be. Hmm. Well, what did I tell ya? More Yuffies, more fun. This looks like a job for the Yuffie squad. How about we take a look over there? Nah, I think we'd have better luck over there. If it's not Materia, I'm not interested. <laughs> she, well, she's just hey, waffling, cloud. isn't she? Uh, Cloud? Are you even listening to us? See? Like I said, fun! No, not fun. Ooh. Wait, she didn't even clone herself, though. <laughs> You could make it. Cloud, Tifa. Once a year, we take a retreat to enjoy the sun and sea breeze. Nothing like getting some gains in the great How many outdoors. are there? Eight. So we what have four. Say? Care to sweat with us? I think I would. I haven't done a proper workout in forever. Chat, I don't want to fucking hear anything. Selves. Train with us as long as you like. You mean it? I don't well, want to hear anything. Here's a question for you, Cloud. <laughs> What would you say is the key to a good workout? <laughs> Fair enough. The heart is the strongest muscle. I but will I'm not behave. Too concerned about that. As you know, our passion for getting pumped up is second to none. Now let's get down to business, shall we? The reason I wanted you to stop by? Monsters have been spotted skulking around the facility and I want them gone. Sure. Should be easy enough. Splendid. We can't train our bodies unless our minds are at ease. So you'll be doing all of us muscle heads a big favor. Let's get out there and kick some ass. Someone's excited. Let's go. Well, yeah. Wanted an excuse to work up a sweat, and now I've got one. Wonder what little Tifa would say. <laughs> I think she'd be pretty proud. Aww, that dialogue's so cute. <laughs> no! Can't really go wrong with Hey, I guess. Wait, I feel what? like. Huh? Oh, sorry. Just some mental meal prep. The ideal post workout dish. <laughs> so, you were the one behind Seventh Heaven's menu? Half was a holdover from the old owner. The better yeah. half is mine. Huh. Should I hate there more? Yeah. <gasps> you snooze, you lose. Oh! oh this dialogue is actually so cute. You snooze, you lose. <laughs> Having Tifa and Aerith on the team, soldiers it's like, choose. it's so broken. Maybe it's so back. broken. Well, I used to be super picky, actually. Really? Used to be. Not anymore, though. Can't be choosers in the slums, either. What about crap? Mm, not a fan. <laughs> yeah, me neither. Oh my god, wait, their chemistry is so good. I feel like they're starting to, like, get lighter. Do you know what I mean? The tension is starting to get lighter. Yeah, they're starting to feel like friends again. Exactly. I love this game so much. It really it really has that magic Final Fantasy 15 feel to it, you know? Where it's like you have these legitimate like relationships with these characters and see them interacting and it's so natural. And it flows so well. Yeah. Look at the girls go. Look at the girls go. They put a lot of thought into making them healthy. Not much into making them tasty. Ugh. <laughs> that face mm. says it all. You know, it's 
funny. What? Didn't realize it at the time, but we ate pretty good when we were kids. Yeah. Homegrown fruits and vegetables, and great chefs eager to use them. I want to have Tifa make me a meal. Tifa, please. Please. Oh, this is cute. You see their friendship coming back onto the stage, you know? Like their friendship truly does have a spotlight now after so much tension. It genuinely for me, like right now, this scene feels like they're getting lighter. You know, there's not as much tension and guilt. How goes the extermination? Our muscles might start to act. Am I not done? Live in fear of fiend attacks. People need to know they're safe to train properly. Well, oh, I'm missing one more. Tifa very much has the older sister vibes. You know how like in Animal Crossing, they have like an archetype that is like older sisterly, kind of like they have those kind of vibes. I don't mean it in like a weird way, right? Like I'm not saying like, oh, Cloud can't be attracted to her because she has older sister vibes, but she has those more mature will take care of you kind of vibes. Do you know what I mean? Whereas I feel like Aerith is a little bratty and more spunky and she'll tease you and like get you out of your comfort zone. Whereas Tifa's like the opposite of that. She's like very nurturing. I really like that with her. Like for me, it's like if I had a problem, like shit hit the fan, I'd want to call Tifa and be like, hey, like, so I fucked up. You know, not saying that Aerith can't be comforting. Aerith is comforting when it's when the time calls for it. But Tifa's energy very much to me is like she she has such older, older sister energy. And again, like I like I'm not saying that to diminish the romantic relationship between Cloud and, and Tifa between people. If people ship Cloud and Tifa, they they see it as like a romantic thing, right? I'm just saying me personally, I really like Tifa because she's like very, very dependable, you know? Finish him off. Sorry, but I got it. That's the last of them. You ready to head back? I'm neither a Clarith nor a Claudi, but I just want to say that watching someone who's so passionate about the game and its relationships is just so wholesome. Oh, that makes me happy. That makes me happy. I love Tifa, but Claire is canon. The way I see it, I feel like they did it like Persona, where there's like, there's definitely a canon ship, but both are very viable options. I don't know. Like, I feel like arguing canon is like kind of irrelevant. It's just how you want to play it, how you think the story should go. I could be wrong. I could be wrong. Maybe at the end of the game, they're going to confirm a ship. Right? Like, that's always possible. But for me, I feel like Clarith is canon to me. Like, genuinely, Clarith is, like, the most beautiful written love story of all time. Whereas, like, I feel like Claudia is, like, a very realistic, very, like, human relationship. You know? And I think it's just dependent on what, like, the player leans more towards. Oh, hey there, Cloud. Tifa. How'd you two took care of our little monster problem? Can't thank you enough. Now we can get back to training being free. Excuse me. Clarith OTP. Sorry about it. Mine. <laughs> you wouldn't happen to be the one who beat these guys in a pull-up contest, would you? Damn. Uh, Watch it, rookie. Don't badmouth us. But that's how it went down, right? <laughs> She's cute. Claire You're truly is my OTP, right? dude. I feel like Claire is the best written love enjoyed. story of, like, one what of the best written here? love stories of all oh. time. Wow. And I'm not your only fan. Look, all of us signed up because we wanted to be just like you. It's just as she says. Thanks to you, our female membership has absolutely skyrocketed. Needless oh, to say, let's go, great. Tifa, the fucking icon. Didn't really do anything. Are you kidding me? You're literally my inspiration. Oh, sh uh, I want to challenge you to a sit up contest. Uh, right now? So, you know, Amina's oh. been training to achieve your look, Tifa. You'd be helping her measure her progress. Let me sweeten the deal. That's true. If Amina doesn't got Tifa superior, abs. I'll add a bonus to your reward. How's that sound? All right, we got to get this special dialogue. We got to get this. Is there a special dialogue? Yes or no? Don't go easy on me, okay? Chat, you better fucking behave.
Just like that. <sighs> that was perfect. <sighs> <laughs> Show off. What? Truly incredible. You're killing it. Beautiful. Okay, let's try it. Let's try this one more time. Wait, you can't mess up at all. You can't mess up at all. What the? gonna be fun oh. how did i mess up i'm so pumped looking good let me see you sweat that was one hell of a workout let's go i was just getting warmed up first try <laughs> wow you got abs of adamantite thanks a lot you put up a good fight though like I said, you're an inspiration to me, to all of us. Nobody's born with a beautiful physique like yours. I can tell you Damn. Out of blood, sweat, and tears into your training. Damn. Honestly, I... Sorry. Thank you. I'm glad I could help. Well, actually, I was hoping that if it's not too much to ask, would you, Tifa, be my muscle mentor? Me? Really? I don't know. By all means, you have my blessing. If you don't mind dropping by from time that to time, that is Sayu. I'm sure you benefit from your advice. That is Sayu's that is voice. If that's what you want, then I'll back you up. Oh my gosh! Thanks, coach. <laughs> mommy ball. What they Muscle. do putting mommy ball in the game, huh? There you go, then. Your extermination <laughs> fee. And as promised, a little extra for helping her out. Come back whenever you want to pump some iron. You're always welcome. I remember when I first played Remake, my, one of my biggest problems with the way that Tifa was depicted is like how at times she was like really insecure. Like she was doubting herself. She was like, we did this, you know? Like she was very, very insecure and not sure of herself and it's so funny how in rebirth we can see her refuse to put herself down like the moment she's about to like put herself down or like play down her accomplishments she'll stop herself and she'll say actually thank you you know when she's about to apologize when she's about to like like um what is it like way down her accomplishments she's like very much like we see it twice now we've seen her stop herself in the middle and be like thank you you know i really love the development that we've seen with tifa next chapter is long all right well tomorrow we start early then all right everybody